What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. And this one today is a little bit different than a lot of my other videos. So today in 2024, it's a lot easier to actually get started Shopify drop shipping than you'd really expect, especially compared to 2018 when everything was so manual. So today we're actually gonna be building a store using AI, tightening it up a little bit, adding copy to the product page and having it fully ready to launch. I'm basically gonna show you how easy and how quick it is to do this in today's day and age. So there's really no excuse if you don't have enough time. All right, let's get right into the video. So this whole software you guys actually have access to for free. So this software will build a store using AI for you in under two minutes. I'm able to provide this to my subscribers because I partnered with Shopify and AutoDS to make this all possible. So not only do you get a free custom built Shopify website, which we're going to be using in this video, but you also get a free full course from me with weekly checklists for over a month. Again, big shout out to Shopify and AutoDS for allowing this to even happen. I can't believe that I'm able to give it away for free, honestly. So if you want to follow along in this video and build your store for free, I'll have a link down below in the description to do this. You can follow me step-by-step step right here. So it's buildyourstore.ai slash Austin Rabin. And here there's a little intro video, which I encourage you to watch if you're going to actually use this tool. The next step, you're going to click on build my free store. All we have to do here is enter our email. So you just plug in your full name, your email, and you get to pick a niche that you actually want to build the store in. So for the example today, we're just going to do pets, click on build my free store and that is it. Now it takes about 30 seconds here to build out the store. Not even, okay, it's already done. And then we get the email and password of the Shopify website. Then we go on to the store URL, log into Shopify to actually activate this store. So we're just gonna go onto the Shopify main page here. We're gonna click log in, click add account, paste the email that they gave you from the build your store here, continue with email. Then we're also gonna paste in the password that they gave you, hit log in, and then you will have access to the store. That's how easy it is. The only thing that you do have to do before you even get started to activate your store and to be able to start selling on it, you do have to choose the Shopify plan. So you can actually do this for just a dollar a month. So I guess the only upfront cost is $1, but you have to have a Shopify plan anyway. So with the discount, you get it for a buck. So you have to select your plan here and then just choose the basic Shopify plan because you don't need to upgrade to any of these right away. So all you do is select basic plan. So all you do is select the basic plan and then purchase that plan and you are good to go. So it's already uploaded products on here. We do have to change some stuff, which is what I'm going to show you in this video, but it uploads the store with winning products already linked to suppliers. Thanks to AutoDS. So in the installed apps, it already installs these for you. You've got bundle bear currency converter reviews and Q and a sticky cart, and then auto DS for the supplier and the fulfillment. So let's take a look at the website and see what we need to adjust to get it ready to launch. So if you click on customize right here, we'll go into the Shopify editor backend here. It's already got some uh, images already uploaded for the pets. Everything layout wise is good. Now let's go to the product page real fast. So a lot of stuff is already done for you. We've got our logo already created. It looks great. It fits perfectly. We've got the header. We've got the product uploaded there, which we need to change the price and all this stuff, which I'll be doing. We've got some description here pulled through. Uh, we've got the features and little charts here. Sorry, it's not showing up well because I'm on mobile. And then at the bottom here, we've got no reviews. So there are a couple things that we need to change copy wise, image wise, I would like to do and add some stuff onto this website, but we're already in a great place. This already saves you like four hours of uploading products and research and building out the website and logo and all that stuff. It's pretty crazy. So now what we need to do is pick a product that we're gonna use as our hero product that we wanna advertise. And also, by the way, if you're using Build Your Store and you sign up for the free custom Shopify store, make sure to check your email. Also check in the spam because that's where you're gonna get the free course from me as well. All right, so back here, let's go into the products. Let's actually pick one that we wanna be selling. So we've got the seven in one dog grooming kit, automatic cat feeder. Uh, let's see here. All right, so for the example today, we're actually gonna go with the cat water feature. So this is a cat water fountain, uh, 8.5 ounces. Some of the product pictures are already pretty good. I do wanna update the main one here, I think. Honestly, I don't know. These are pretty good already. Like these are pretty nicely branded images here. I don't actually think that we need to change too much about this. So the images I actually think are fine. So we're gonna remove all the description though and put some custom stuff in here as well as a title for the product. What I'm gonna be using for that is gonna be Dropbot AI. Dropbot AI does everything for ideation, content creation for you, all of that stuff. Basically all marketing ideation done for you using AI. So what we actually need is a product name. That's what we wanna change first. So we're gonna plug in cat water fountain here and we're gonna just gonna do brand names and see what it comes up with for that. All right, so we got Purse Springs, Aqua Feline, Whisker Waters. I like Whisker Waters. All right, we're going with Whisker Waters here. Again, we're not being too picky because we're doing a little speed round here. So we've got Whisker Waters. So we changed it to Whisker Waters Automatic Cat Fountain. So now we're 
we're gonna scroll down and change the price and the color. So the color is only one, there's stainless steel. So we're actually gonna delete that because we don't need that option there if there's only one type of material and option. So we're gonna delete both of these. So there's only one product selection now. Now it's gonna tighten up our above the fold section on our product page, which we'll come back to. And now we're gonna have to change the price of the product. So you can see here, it's already plugged in from AutoDS through their supplier, which is super, super nice. The cost per the item there is $2.73. The cost for this water fountain is $27.93. So we're gonna mark this up about two times. We're gonna put it at $49.99. We're gonna have the compare price at $69.99. And that's giving us a margin of 44%. So that's giving us a margin of 44%. You can see here, AutoDS is already connected with the uh, product inventory as well. And we've also got the weight plugged in there. So we're good on this front of the product here. We're gonna go ahead and hit save. Okay, so now let's reload it on the back end here in the Shopify theme editor and see if the you know title of the product looks good here. Whisker Waters Automatic Cap Found. I like the colorways already going on here. Again, product images look pretty good. The next thing that we wanna change, I think I'm gonna remove the quantity selector specifically for this product. I don't really know why you'd need more than one. I guess you have a bunch of cats maybe, but I don't think it's super necessary for this product. So we're gonna remove that, tighten that up a bit. We've got the add to cart. Now we go down to the icon with text. So we do wanna switch this up a little bit. So let's think about some of the marketing angles for this product that we can actually start implementing onto this website because the stronger marketing angles that you have, especially in your advertisements in landing page, the higher chance of success that you're gonna have. You're gonna have higher conversion rates. You're gonna resonate with your audience a lot more. So let's go back into Dropbot and actually pull up some marketing angles here. So for the marketing angles, we've got quench your cat thirst promote kidney health that's interesting constant water refills picky drinker i kind of like picky drinker cats crave running water i like that too okay i, I like those two i kind of want a combination of both i want it to be like a stimulating experience to allow your cat to drink more water or encourage your cat to drink more water so i'm gonna take a little bit of both of those angles and kind of use that as our main one here so we have to go back into here and we're gonna change these icons to kind of match that angle. So I'm gonna go with the first one with healthy hydration. Maybe there's like a little, what is, what is washing? What icon is that? Okay, I like that, it's perfect. So we're also gonna do stimulates a natural stream. Uh, maybe play on the fact, we'll play on it a little bit later on that it, you know, cats like to drink naturally from the wild and puddles and streams or whatever. So it puts them back in their primitive state. So for this one, I think I'm just gonna go straight with a heart. We can do custom logos or we can do custom icons in here, but I don't know if I want to spend the time on that. This is a kind of a speed run. Maybe there's like, oh, leaf, or er, leaf, that's even better. Okay, stimulates a natural stream, that makes sense. Secure checkout, I don't think I'm gonna do secure checkout. We're gonna take away actually from the marketing angle, we're gonna do like 30 day returns here. And then we're gonna change this one to, I think we're gonna do a truck on this one, or they have like a gift maybe. Yeah, let's do the box. Next, we've got our guarantees. We stand by our product with a 30 day risk-free guarantee. If you're not completely thrilled with your order, perfect. That matches this. Shipping and returns. Shipping and returns, we obviously have to do um, on your own. It depends on where you're shipping to. Um, so, you know, if your shipping time is five days versus seven days to the UK or something like that, you'd have to look into that. So we're gonna leave that for now. Let's go into mobile view actually. So what we're actually gonna do below that is gonna be a TikTok. So I'll show you guys how to embed a TikTok. It's more stimulating. It's nice to, you know, showcase your product. So we're actually gonna try to find a TikTok video of this exact product that we can use and embed. So we're gonna look up automatic cat water fountain and let's see, where's the one with the little spout? Oh, is this it? It's kind of close. Honestly, we're gonna go with this one. It's not the exact same product, but I'm not gonna spend too much time looking for it. So how to do this, all you have to do is go into the embed section on the right here, click it, copy the code. So then all you have to do is come back on here, click insert video, paste that code, and it'll show up like this. But when you go on your website, you've got the TikTok video automatically playing right below. So next below that, we're gonna add another page break, kind of emphasizing the marketing angles that we're running with. So we'll click add section, and we're gonna do a rich text here, and we're gonna move it above the review app. Okay, and we're gonna remove the button because I don't need that button right here. Now let's change the color scheme of this. Let's make it a little different. Uh, yeah, let's do that one. So we're gonna go back into Dropbot here and see what we can come up with. I'm taking the marketing angle that we're using, plugging it in the additional information. And we need something small, so let's do hooks. Okay, so I'm gonna take this from the hooks here, make hydration hassle-free, I like that. Come back on here, and then we're gonna need a little bit of a description here about why you should be doing that, hitting the marketing angle even harder. Oh, I like this actually, we're gonna copy that. This is a pretty good one. Delete this, paste it from there. Okay, I like that, that's good, hit save. Now we're gonna go down and add some more kind of content. So we're gonna add some more sections here. So I think we're gonna add a multi-row actually with some images. So let's move this up right here. And we are gonna remove the button from each of these first. All right, so now we need to get some images plugged in here and then talk about the product and the marketing angle even more. This would be where UGC comes in handy. If you have the product yourself, you can take your own images with your own cat, but I don't have that. So we're gonna see if we can find any on 
Google here. I can't get too picky because I don't have the exact product here. I mean, maybe we can actually just pull it from TikTok, possibly. All right, let's actually just take a little snip of this TikTok right here and use that as an image. Okay, so we're gonna grab that, save this image real fast. All right, uploaded the image here. Let's see if it turns out okay. It's not bad, but we need to make this desktop position a little different. Adapt to image, there we go, hit save. This should actually update, I believe. Yep, there we go, so updated to HD. That looks pretty good, not gonna lie. Let's do another header here. So we're gonna remove the caption. Let's do this, so. Okay, so we're gonna do a healthy cat is a happy cat. Something from Dropbot about water consumption. We'll just take whatever we find right off the bat here and we'll throw it in. In. Now we want two more images here. I'll grab two from TikTok really quick, just to use those examples. All right, so I just took two more screenshots from TikTok and they actually fit pretty nicely, kind of same colorway too. So again, we're gonna do the same thing with this row right here. We're gonna remove the caption. All right, we're gonna say it stimulates a cat's natural instinct to drink running water. Let's go back on the Dropbox and get some product descriptions there that we could probably throw in. Okay, so this one is perfect for that. So we're gonna plug that one right in here. And the last one, actually Dropbot, we're gonna remove the caption first, but Dropbot came up with a pretty good angle for it here for urinary tract infections if they don't drink enough water. So we're gonna take that one and use that as part of our angle as well. We're gonna plug that one into the description here. Prevent health related issues. Boom, there we go. So we've got that going for us. We'll hit save. I do wanna adjust this a little bit. I think I wanna use, uh, go into the multi row. And I think I wanna change the color of it. So we go back in here, color scheme. Uh, the container one, I think we want background two. Yeah, that looks a little better. A little accent color there. So we'll save that. Let's also take a look at desktop view to see how that's looking. I mean, looking pretty good. Almost ready to roll here. So go back to mobile. Let's finish up the website. Underneath this type of section, I would add like a frequently asked questions section. So we would go here. And for that, I like to add collapsible content as the row. So we'll pull that up. And then we're gonna rename this. We're gonna name it FAQs. And we're gonna pretend that these are filled. I'm not gonna research some frequently asked questions right now, but you guys get the point. All right, so I've got three here just for the example. We've got how long does it last? Is it safe? How many cats can share it? Also going in here on the icon section and changing them to question marks. It makes more sense. And then let's change the color scheme a a little bit here. I want it to stand out more. Let's try it. Oh no, accent one. Yep. I think that's better. And then below that section, I usually like to have like the reviews type of section or more testimonial style and then the actual reviews. So the website's already come loaded with a product reviews widget, but I like to do testimonial ones with pictures as well. So we'll throw in the slideshow. We'll have like three testimonials, but what I do is like you can pull an image of someone with their cat off of like pexels.com or something like that for free to use. And then I'll throw it in here with the testimonial. All right, so I'm just gonna pull it from pexels. I typed in lady with cat. This one looks nice. So we're gonna download this for free and we're gonna go back on to the store and plug it in. Then we'll hit done here and the image slide. We can probably remove that. We can also remove the button. We don't need the button there. And then for the subheading, uh, that's where like you put in the review. So we'll do like a quote. Okay, so I just said, save my cat's life. Mr. Whiskers always had a hard time staying hydrated. He is obsessed with the new found from Taylor R. So you just do that with a slideshow of a couple of different testimonials and we can actually label this with a description. So to do that, we'll add a section here with rich text and actually just pop it drag it right above the slideshow. Again, we're gonna delete uh, this section right here, the buttons, talk about your brand. So we're actually gonna say something like, we'll say what other cat lovers are saying about us. Medium, maybe small there, uh, we'll do medium. And then we're gonna change the color of this to break it up a little bit more as well. I know, cause that's actually gonna be above this. So let's do that one and we'll move we need to move this above the app section here and then move the slideshow up above that as well. Yep, there we go. The last thing that we wanna do is add the reviews here and pull them from AliExpress directly into this app. And then you are pretty much set up and good to go. So if you take a look at the website, I mean, this took no time at all. We've got our logo, the colorway is already fantastic. We adjusted some things, adjusted a marketing angle. We have the embedded TikTok. We've got some more content down here talking about the angles, some testimonials, some frequently asked questions, and we are pretty much set. And then if you look at it in desktop, it also looks really nice nice. So everything is pretty seamless. It looks great. Looks like a high quality website. That's because it is. And then we're done. That's pretty much as fast as I could possibly make a website ready to launch. Thanks to the AI that I've been using. It makes it so much easier to test stores way faster and way more efficiently. And then once you start running advertisements to this landing page, you have AutoDS on the back end already linked as the supplier. Let me show you quickly how to do that. So you know exactly how to fulfill your orders. We're going to go into the app section and click on AutoDS. It'll take you to this page with your email, plug in the email from the store, plug 
plug in your full name, hit join. Choose the plan that you would like. It depends on how many products you're gonna be importing, plus some other features that you might need. We'll just click start now for free. Then once you get access, you will be on the back end right here. This is where you can see all of your orders, have your automatic order fulfillment set up. You can look at the products on the marketplace to have the fastest shipping times. There also is a winning product section to look for new ones as well. Since everything is already linked onto your store for the automatic order fulfillment, all you would have to do is go into your settings, click on buyer accounts, click add account, match the supplier information, add your payment method, add your payment method, and then go down to settings and put the max amount of orders that you wanna order a day. Once that's all set up and linked to your store, so let's say you got 10 orders that came in. Automatically, the next day, AutoDS will already fulfill those orders for you. And they'll link all the tracking information that you need onto Shopify and it gets sent out to the customer. So you really don't have to do anything at all. It's pretty hands off. So guys, that's how easy it is to build a Shopify store in 2024 with all of these great tools that we have available now. This would have taken me hours, if not days, to build this back in 2017, 2018 when I started. It's pretty crazy how far along e-commerce in general has come. So it really is just a perfect time to get into it. If you want to check out anything that I'm talking about in this video, you want to get your custom store, AutoDS, Dropbot, everything is in the description down below. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. It was a little different. It's like a challenge and also like how fast I could build a store. If you guys like this one, make sure to leave a like, hit the subscribe button and leave a comment down below. All right, guys, as always, thanks for watching and I'll see you guys next time.